Alrighty. The Way of the Witch uh, by Danielle Lewitt, um, illustrated by Tamara Woods, because there's a few illustrations throughout. A guide to starting your magical journey and activating your inner power. So, um, decent, um, um, size, um, for, like, this is a beginner book. Um, and so, um, part one, the beginning, part two, building your practice, and part three is correspondences. So, um, so like, which, which, um, there's like three or four, like, guest articles, and you know it, because like, it says guest article, and it's italicized, um, and like in the witch witch you got like some a few further readings that you could do um okay so more than like three or four um so like suggest tools um and she does say throughout you don't have to get she does say at a few points like you don't have to have everything um that's kind of like shown in this book and you don't need to have like anything fancy. You don't need like a full on ornate chalice. That cup, that mug you use every day for coffee, that would be fine as well. <laughs> um, there's a few like spells and rituals placed throughout as well. Um, and she just does try add a few points um like if you have trouble difficulty um standing or walking um tries to make like a few like um suggestions um if you can't do that um see your shoes sock slippers as an extension of your body and make that connection that way um, if you can if you're in a wheelchair or can't touch the ground, hold on to any part of your chair and see it as a conductor of your energy, um, that type of thing. Um, altars, um, sacred space in your altar, uh, types, so like, um, Personal, working, deity, um, and a few others. So like ethical, uh, it's just an ethical section, like cultural appropriation, close practices, smudging, um, other ethical practices. Um, So when she gets to spells, rituals, and records, so um, guidelines to keep in mind when attempting to create your own. So keeping it simple, short, clean, and basically asking you like the five W's and H. So who, what, where, when, why, and how. Um, so some rituals, uh, magic, keeping magical records. So, a Book of Shadows or a Grimoire, so, like, um, what are they? Um, working with herbs, um, like, growing them, using them in spells. Um, connecting with them, and, like, and then she goes into crystals, and she, and she, um, goes back into, like, the ethical practices of, like, how was that crystal brought to the store that you are, um, how to use them, so keeping them with you, using them in spells, um, safely using them, and then goes into uh, divination practices, um, 
So the different types of cards, Tarot Oracle, um, Nomad, Message Cards, um, and then talks about other forms of divination, runes, pendulum, tassamen, siege, um, scrying, um, DD or non-DD work, um, spirits, holidays, and does mention that not everyone's going to experience the holidays the same or if at all and if you don't connect with say um like yule or like the winter's time you don't have to have it or um litha or um beltane or whatever and you can have your own like personal wheel like are there certain days or is there like a certain um, um, like newborn animal that appears at a certain time? Um, it does go through the eight Sabbaths. Um, Celebrate and a solo practice. Um, practice under the radar, so not totally um, drawing attention to yourself. So, like getting out in nature, um, using clothes and makeup. So, the color of your shirt, the color of your makeup, um, food and drink. Like, what are you eating? What are you making? Um, when you're coming out, um, online reminders, um, so like being aware of what might happen if you're sharing stuff online. Um, and then the correspondences, so like further learning, she has, she does have a list of, um, I think it's just, yeah, her main social media is, um, Instagram, so she. She's listing um, Instagram accounts. A number of these people do have, also have like YouTube channels. Um, Cause like um, Warrior, Witch Nike, Witch of Wonderlust, and Chaotic Witch Ant. Um, I know though um, those creators have um, channels, and I'm pretty sure like a few others as well. Um, podcasts. Um, tarot, and then goes into what a tip of what a lot of people think of, um, like to me what a uh, like correspondence section would be. So like crystals for like anxiety, calming, courage, um, colors, days of the week, direction, herbs by intention, um, the moon. Um, the full moon, so she has like northern hemisphere meaning and like southern hemisphere meaning. Um, seasons, tarot basics, um, zodiac signs, um, another guest article, and then, um, then you're at the end of the book. So really beginner type of uh book things aren't overly explained it's you you are getting an introduction to a number of different topics some of the topics you may not be interested some you may are and you could go further um with them with some of the people that she's referenced in the back in her correspondence section um if you're more interested in like astrology there's like about six people there. Um, I just mentioned there's like, oh, like 20, 24 different people that um, the author has um, mentioned in the back. So um, you can go from there. Um,
but um, yeah, she's all she also wrote a uh, witch's book of shadow spells, ritual sabbaths, and journal grimoir, and creator of a witch's house online social persona. Um, 18 years of witchcraft. Um, so, yeah, um. Uh, yeah, a really more recent release of um, a beginner type of book if this is more um, your idea of um, starting out your journey as a witch and to kind of spread um, elsewhere in different terms and stuff. So yeah, the way of the witch. Happy readings.